In this video, I'll be showing you how to delegate to a delegate representative or a DREP within a Daedalus wallet. Now, Daedalus is one of those really popular wallets that is still being used out there. It's a full node wallet. So if you're coming into the Cardano ecosystem for the first time, this may not be the best wallet for you. But if you're an OG, if you've been in the Cardano ecosystem for uh, since the beginning, you're probably and may be still using Daedalus. And you will need to now delegate to a DREP in the next era of governance for Cardano so that you can continuously withdraw your rewards from your wallet. So it's one of those things to try and incentivize users to start delegating to DREPs and participating in governance in general. Now, if you manage to sync your Daedalus wallet, which uh, took me about a week to do from scratch, and then I had to sync my wallet transactions as well, so that took a, a really long time. But once you've got that up and running, you can click on voting on the left-hand side here in the menu. And you have the option here for governance, and you also have, have uh, Project Catalyst. Now, these two things are completely different. Catalyst is like a mini shark tank within the Cardano ecosystem. It has around uh, maybe twice a year or three times a year, depending on uh, when and how quickly they can organize these rounds. But the governance area here will allow you to vote on various uh, proposals that are put up within the ecosystem. And these are very large proposals, such as the Cardano budgets. So all these budgets that will be going around for future events, marketing, uh, development of the chain, and so, so on. So there's a lot of this going on at the moment. You can find out more about this on the gov.tools website, where you can actually have a look at all the proposals and governance actions that are proposed to the Cardano community at the moment as well. Now let's get back to Daedalus here. From this point, depending on how many wallets you have, you can select the wallet that you want to delegate to a particular DREP. In this case, I'll select my main wallet here. And then down below, you have the options to abstain from voting or choose no confidence. There are two default ones you can set and forget essentially. But if you really wanna drive the ADA ecosystem, it's highly recommended that you delegate to a DREP. And this is where you can paste in a DREP's ID. Now you may be wondering who are all these DREPs and you can find out more about the various DREPs in the ecosystem by going to this DREP directory, which is on the GovTools website here. So this is the directory, DREP directory from the top menu. And you can see the various people that have put their hands up to be DREPs and the amount of uh, voting power that has been delegated to the various uh, DREPs out there. This is my particular ID here. So you can copy that particular ID and then go back to Daedalus Wallet and paste this in here. This will allow you to then delegate your wallet to this particular DREP. Now I have to mention delegating to a DREP doesn't mean you give them your ADA. You're literally just pointing your wallet to this particular person and allowing them to vote on your behalf. It's very similar to staking where you're not uh, locking in your ADA or sending your ADA to a stake pool. You're just pointing your wallet to a particular stake pool so that uh, they can mint the blocks on your behalf and then you can earn the rewards that way. So DREPs work in a very similar manner where you're pointing to a particular DREP. So I've pasted in my DREP ID there. I click on submit. From here, you need to type in your sending password. I won't do that at this point in time, but this will uh, submit the transaction online and uh, delegate your wallet to the particular DREP that you have chosen. And that's it. This will enable your wallet to participate within the era of Cardano governance. You'll be able to withdraw your wards after the next hard fork. So it's Chang2 or the Polym hard fork, which we are looking for at the moment. And if you want to learn more about DREPs in general, do check out the GovTools website. There's a lot of resources on there. And if you are wanting to use a different wallet, so like one of these light wallets here, Lace, Eternal, Uroi, or Typhon, one of these wallets are absolutely fantastic. And it, the delegation process using one of these wallets is really easy via the GovTools website. I have lots of tutorials about uh, how to use those particular wallets and how to delegate or even become a DREP yourself, registering on that uh, GovTools website and uh, participating in the era of Cardano governance that way too. Now, if you learned something here, if you enjoyed the video, if you're still a avid Daedalus wallet fan, 
please give this video a big thumbs up on the way out. Hit the subscribe and notification bell, and I'll keep you guys up to date with everything that's happening in the Kidano ecosystem. Catch you in the next video.